There is no such thing as a vegan baby. A vegan baby dies. Alright guys, welcome back to the channel. If you're new, my name is Bobby. Guys, today we're gonna check out Ellen Fisher with her newest video, What My Vegan Baby and I Ate Today. No such thing as a vegan baby. Let's have a look. Fantastic. Oxalate beverage. I'm sure. Great idea to drink wine and breastfeed. Okay, starting the day with a mango. Nothing wrong with a mango. However, a mango just gives you sugar, vitamin C, a bit of fiber, a bit of hydration. That's pretty much it. What kind of is Oh, it's so good. Mm. As I said many times before, those fruits are bred in nature, in a wild environment. They wouldn't be so sweet. There is no big difference between a glass of Coke and a mango. As always, not enough carbs. That mango is not enough sugar. So therefore, they use grains. Fantastic. A bunch of phytates, a bunch of gluten, and of course, needless to say, this is very, very tough on the digestion and will wreck your gut. That's it. Super unhealthy. More sugar. But it's healthy because it's a banana. Homemade almond hemp milk. Fantastic. Why use regular milk? How's yours? What was that? Yeah. Is that some tofu scramble or so? I can't tell. Can't recognize it. Of course, of course. It's quite hysterical to see that the vegans really don't understand this. Cookbook after cookbook after cookbook. If you're eating meat, you don't need fancy recipes. A steak is enough. Yeah, you know. Wanna bite a mango? The whole channel is built upon her family, essentially using her kids for clout. Of course not. You're only three. Johnny. But people watch it. Wow. Well, it's their fault. Very nice boy. I get questions all the time on how I start my kids on solid food. And Kovacs is a year and a half now, so he's eating a lot of food. And we really just feed our kids what we eat. We don't do like the separate different kinds of foods really um, sure but you don't mention that you breastfeed as i said in the beginning there is no such thing as a vegan baby a vegan baby dies this is what happens we had studies on that we had cases news etc vegan babies die your babies are still here because they breastfeed Just that's the only nutrition diet. they're getting you're gonna do a braid in your own hair nobody survives on mango no. Almond and hemp combo with just a few dates, a little bit of vanilla, pinch of salt, lots of water, blend, and then I also like to add fresh coconut milk. You can add like canned full fat. That's not milk. That as well, and it's such a creamy, delicious plant milk. Super creamy, super delicious. The water amount that is used for almonds is destroying our environment. You riding your skateboard? Vegans don't care. Can you help, mommy? They still don't get it. I said it before, countless times, yet again, kale is super toxic, not even sheep would eat it. But vegans do. Put some in the blender. They love it. Smoothie. Yummy, smoothie. Yummy. Super disgusting, it tastes absolutely horrific, this is why you make a smoothie out of it. If it would be really delicious, and it would be your species specific diet, then you would simply eat the kale like so. But as I said, not even sheep do it. You being the ultimate sheep, you blend it and add a ton of sugar. Yeah, push it in. I guess. Oh. Let's have a look. Prove me wrong. That looks good, doesn't no it? No chance. How does yeah. it look good? Got some frozen banana. And there we go. Put it in the blender. I rest my Put case. Go. <laughs> so you're eating fruits all day. You're eating sugar 
all day. You have zero protein, as always, no cholesterol, you have no building blocks, no saturated fats, nothing, simply sugar. However, your milk does. This is why your kids are alive. Oh, is it cold? Now we're going to add some hemp. And as you can see, the kid eats the mango. It would never touch the kale. Why do you put the kale into the shake? Why? Because somebody told you that it's healthy. That's it. I'm buy the mango. <laughs> somebody told me. <laughs> wow. Stand up. Stand up. Yeah. Disgusting, man. Absolutely repulsive. Again, the only reason why this is somewhat enjoyable is because of the sugar. Oh, buddy. Nice and cold. Is it cold? Mm. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> You can't decide which one he wants. Bye bye. Bye. Look at. Mama. Don't you remember? <laughs> what did I just say? Where? I don't really understand why you would film yourself breastfeeding, Sometimes but what do I know? Crawl into a cozy cave and sleep. Oh, so cringe, man. It's a bat. Why should the world see this? This is family time. This is intimacy between you and your child. Why would you share it with the whole world to see? Absolutely disgusting. But aside from that, you are proving my point. No such thing as a vegan kid. No such thing as a vegan baby. Your baby is not vegan. It gets a bunch of protein and all the soluble vitamins that are found in fat, in saturated fats. This is your mother's milk. You won't find any of those nutrients in your plants. Have you ever thought about why that is? Wow. Wow. Ooh, how pretty. Okay. The Okinawan purple sweet potato. That's why the Okinawans are healthy, because of that sweet potato right there. It's not because of the pork they're eating. No, no, no. So good. Often called just like a Japanese sweet potato. This is going to be so delicious in the salad. And then when Kovax wakes up, I'm sure he'll want some. And just condiments all the time. Vegans only eat condiments. And he'll Carbs. Some avocado toast. He loves Carbs. avocado toast. And we lately have been eating sourdough bread. Yo. But we like to mix it up. Sometimes we do like the sprouted wheat. Cannot go wrong. In the end, all the suffering is self-inflicted. If you must, go ahead. A time is coming where meat will be heavily taxed and all of us peasants will get much, much less meat to enjoy. You, on the other hand, torture yourself already. <laughs> Fantastic. <laughs> Okay, potatoes. Just vegetation. They're so juicy. Oh my gosh, I can't even tell you how sweet these are. The yeah, sweetness. The closer you can That's get what to you need. ripeness, the better they taste. Why would you eat like this? It doesn't make any logical sense whatsoever. Again, you have a bunch of oxalate-ridden greens, you have a bunch of lectins in the chickpeas, and the rest is just as useless. Panini makes a Why? perfect dressing when you pair it with sauerkraut or lemon juice. And I like to add you don't enjoy and this. potatoes to my salads to make it a really hearty meal. I love to be satisfied off a big salad. That's a contradiction. Nobody's satisfied after a salad, and you know that. Those high-calorie plant foods into Why your salads. Why are you lying? Why are you always lying? like avocado, different kinds of beans. My favorite is garbanzo beans in a salad. Sure. And chopped baked potatoes. We're having those on the side too, it could be really good. So, never mind. I won't be feeding these potatoes to Kovacs because I put way too much pepper on them for Kovacs to enjoy them. So you do understand that too much pepper is not healthy for the baby. Why do you assume that it's healthy for you? Wakes up, a lot of times I'm so busy with the kids and busy with work that I'm like, ah just don't want to spend the energy on like making a fresh meal and I'll just grab leftovers which is still great too and still like 
nourishing for you, obviously, because we're... Yeah, obviously. <laughs> what is nourishing about it? Absolutely nothing, man. You simply cooked up a bunch of plants, put them in the fridge and reheated them. What is nutritious about that? Making really healthy wow. dinners at night, like curries and soups and... What is healthy about curries and soups? Explain. You don't know it. Um, pastas with lots of veggies in them, but... Yeah, pasta is super healthy because you added veggies on top. And wow, it man. It's so good to make a fresh salad and I never regret taking the time to make a really filling salad. Oh, wow. Hi, How old is this kid, man? Looks kind of old for breastfeeding, if you ask me personally. But yet again, thank God he is still breastfeeding, otherwise he would be dead. You Unbelievable. Want no nutrients here. Yet again, you have a bunch of plant oils on grains. You do understand that this is not human nutrition. Do you get this? Mm. Bye. Wow. Mm. Is it good? So Kofax has his avocado toast. I'm gonna put some garbanzo beans on there and call it a snack. Yeah, amazing snack. Torture. Ooh, snack. Poor little dude, man. I'm gonna grow up. I'm gonna hate your mom. Irresponsible. Okay, what does this try to replicate? No idea. You obviously trick your kids into believing they're eating something nutritious, aka animal foods. Wow. Is that how you spell the Is that what you're saying? Yeah. But the thing is, she doesn't even know that. That's really the point. She doesn't understand apparently what she is doing. And the husband is allowing it. <laughs> yeah, freaking good. I believe you. It's just a bunch of pasta. Wow. The only thing nutritious about a lasagna is obviously the meat and the cheese. Uh, all right guys and this is it for today's video absolutely heartbreaking especially for me as a father seeing this here a crazy mother on the loose malnourishing her children and the husband isn't doing anything about it but they honestly don't see it they think everything is a-okay until they see what they have done to their children. They will see the defects that they have done, the degeneration that they caused when the children grow up, when they stop breastfeeding. Absolutely disgusting. All right, but this is it for today. If you enjoyed the video, leave it a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed already, guys, please do so. And if you want to support the channel, all the links are in the description box below for you to check out. Thank you very much. All right, as always, may God bless you all. Much love and peace.